So just doing a quick tutorial. On the left we have a air source to water heat pump. On the right is an air to air heat pump. There are disconnects on the right there. Water lines in the back they're insulated. It's got a 50% mixture of glycol and water going inside. So down here we have our radiant manifolds, our buffer tank, it's just a regular Aosmith water heater that we tied into. Um, got our circular air control up top here, Ranco control. If the tank here isn't up to 110 degrees, then the outdoor unit there, that Solstice Extreme, kicks on. And then our Wi-Fi control for a T-stat for upstairs. Here's the circulator, Grunfoss 1558, that goes to the outdoor unit on high speed. Uh, just three zones, all radiant in slab. We're going to try to do radiant cooling here as well. See how that goes in the summertime. Inside here we have the mini split Mitsubishi indoor head. I think it's a high two outside, low ambient air to air heat pump. I think this is an 18,000 BTU indoor head. It's got the sensing eye up there. Infrared detects hot spots, cold spots, adjusts accordingly. Yeah, the customer seems pretty happy.